she no doubt has her hopes on one of the main awards of the evening after being nominated in the Outstanding Performance by a Female Actor in a Leading Role category for her take on Mary Poppins. And Emily Blunt certainly left an impression in the style stakes, as she attended the 25th Annual Screen Actors Guild Awards at the Shrine Auditorium in L.A. on Sunday evening. The 35-year-old Mary Poppins returns actress lead a whole host of British stars on the red carpet, including Rachel Weisz and Catherine Zeta-Jones, who both looked equally stunning as they made their rivals. Emily, accompanied by her husband John Krasinski, opted for a statement look and showcased her slender physique in a glitzy pink gown, which featured dramatic structured satin detailing up the sides. Her show-stopping sleeveless number was adorned in sequins all over. However she added further glyphs with a pair of drop earrings and a selection of chunky rings, which she wore on her manicured hands. The star's makeup look perfectly complemented her Barbie pink gown, while opting for a soft glam look, Emily tied it all together with a pink lip. Emily sleeked her golden locks back into a slick bun, which made the most of her pretty features and kept the attention on her eye-catching gown. She posed for pictures alongside pal Rachel proving that there is no animosity as they go head-to-head -head in the outstanding performance by a female actor in a supporting role category. Emily has been nominated for her role in A Quiet Place, while Rachel hopes to win the gong for the favorite. And while their dresses couldn't have been more different, the women both chose to model up those for the evening, with Emily wearing her blonde hair slicked back in a low bun while Rachel had her brunette lock squaffed into a braided chignon by Dove celebrity stylist Mark Townsend. Tonight's look was inspired by the asymmetrical neckline of her velvet and feathered Givenchy gown, Mark revealed. I gave her a slightly off-center part with a lot of texture to draw attention to the hair. To create that texture, without any unwanted frizz, Mark prepped Rachel's hair with the Dove Care Between Washes Restyling Milk before spritzing the actress's locks with the Dove Style Plus Care Shine Heat Protection Spray for good measure. The style was then locked into place, and given a final dose of shine, courtesy of the brand's Style Plus Care Compressed Micro Mist Extra Hold Hair Spray. Catherine revealed the secret to maintaining the heat in her marriage to Michael Douglas, when the couple took to the red carpet at the SAG Awards. He likes to watch me tap dance now and again said the 49-year-old of her 74-year-old husband. The Chicago actress flashed her long, lean legs in a royal blue dress with a thigh-high split. The garment also boasted a plunging neckline which showcased the Oscar winner's cleavage. Her brunette dresses were one loose end with a center part for the red carpet turn. Michael meanwhile looked dapper in a tuxedo, which he paired with blue-tinted glasses. Hugh Grant's depiction of Jeremy Thorpe in A Very English Scandal earned him a nomination for Outstanding Performance by a Male Actor in a Television Movie. And hoping he did enough to secure the win, Hugh Grant attended the 25th Annual Screen Actors Guild Awards at the Shrine Auditorium in L.A. on Sunday evening. The 58-year-old actor was joined by his wife Anna Eberstein, who looked sensational in a thigh-raising black mini-dress as she showed her support on the red carpet. Anna displayed her toned pins in the stylish sleeveless number, which featured silver button detailing along the shoulders. She accessorized with look with a pair of statement sparkling drop earrings, and a branded chunky silver bangle, while clutching a sequined evening bag in her hand. The television producer added extra inches to her already statuesque frame, with a pair of strappy stilettos, which featured a pointed toe dot joining Hugh and Anna at the awards was Joseph Fiennes and his stunning wife Maria Dolores de Guez. Opting for light touches of neutrally toned makeup, Anna also sported an understated hairstyle, sweeping her chestnut locks back off her face. Meanwhile, Hugh looked equally dashing in a simple black tuxedo, which he paired with a crisp white shirt and a black bow tie. Joining Hugh and Anna at the awards was Joseph Fiennes and his stunning wife Maria Dolores de Guez. The 48-year-old actor showed a touch of class as he opted to don a single-breasted black suit and bow tie, which boasted a velvet lapel, as he attended the event on Sunday evening. Joseph tucked a black pocket square into his breast pocket and kept to the archetypal look with a white shirt underneath. His perfectly manicured beard was filled with wisps of salt and pepper adding adding an extra touch of elegance to his look.
Maria looked stunning as well, pulling photographers' lenses toward her as she wowed in a plunge in black dress with studded detailing. She couldn't stop smiling as she stared proudly at her husband and held her arm around his waist, as the pair posed for photographs. Joseph and Maria were married in 2009 in Tuscany, and share two children together, Sam, 9, and Isabel, 8. In television categories, the marvelous Mrs. Meisel and Ozark led with four nominations each. Barry, Glow, The Handmaid's Tale and The Kaminsky Method trailed close behind with three nominations each. Making their first public appearance as newlyweds, Alan Leach and wife Jessica Blair Herman put on a loved-up display as they joined the rest of the British stars at the event. Actress and producer Jessica, 32, perfected a simple yet elegant look, as she took to the red carpet at the Shrine Auditorium wearing a chic floor-length red gown. They looked every inch the picture-perfect couple as they joked around for the cameras while making their way into the prestigious event. Jessica who produced and starred in American Crime Story, teamed her figure-hugging red gown with a selection of glitzy jewels. She wore her chestnut locks in an elegant updo, leaving curled strands to frame her pretty features, while opting for a soft palette of makeup. Meanwhile, Alan, 37, cut a dapper figure in a sharp black tuxedo, complete with bow tie and sparkling dress shoes. Crazy Rich Asian star Gemma Chan, 36, Wild in a pretty pink frock that had a one-shoulder design, and a waterfall-style hemline that flowed into a train behind her. The actress's playful, undone hairstyle was created by Clarice Rubenstein for Dove Hair and Olivia Garden, who explained that she used Gemma's voluminous dress as inspiration for the look. Gemma is wearing this incredible dress with lots of volume and a long train, Clarice explained. I wanted her hair to be modern and youthful. She is way too cool to have quaffed polished hair with this look. To get the actress's hair ready to go, Clarice brushed it through with the Olivia Garden Eye Detangle Brush, while using the Dove Care Between Washes Rehydrating Mist to get the locks slightly damp. Then I used the Olivia Garden Ceramic Plus Ion Hair Dryer and the Olivia Garden Eco Hair Thermal Round Brush to dry and reshape the hair, Clarice continued. Once the hair was dry, I alternated between a curling iron and flat iron to create the perfect undone waves. While curling, I spritzed Dove Care Between Washes and Invisible Dry Shampoo, which is a game changer for dark hair because there is zero product residue left behind, from the crown to the root of the head, creating additional body and lift throughout. After pulling the hair into a low playful knot, Clarice then secured it with the Dove Style Plus Care Compressed Micro Mist Flexible Hold Hairspray. He played the greatest version of The Dark Knight to date and it seems Christian Bale and wife C.B. Blazik took their fashion cues from him on Sunday night. The couple of 19 years arrived for the ceremony in Hollywood and each in an all-black ensemble. Bale was nominated for one of the big ones on the night, outstanding performance by a male actor in a leading role, for his turn as Dick Cheney in Vice. He was up against Bradley Cooper for A Star Is Born. Rami Malek for Bohemian Rhapsody, Viggo Mortensen for Green Book, and John David Washington for Black K.K. Klansman.